So let's see how we find the slope if we're given the graph of a line. The easiest thing to do is to simply pick out two points on the line and use those in the slope formula. Then we can use the shape of the graph to determine um, if we're in the right ballpark. Okay, so I'm going to choose the points for you because I can see up close here. So it looks like 5, 1 is a good point. All right over here. And you can pick any one of these others. I'll go ahead and take negative 1, negative 3 for my second point. So now I have two points, and I'm going to use our slope formula. So m is, remember, y sub 2 minus y sub 1 over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. You might know that as delta y over delta x. And we will just plug those values in, being careful with our arithmetic. So 1 minus negative 3 for the top. You could go in the other direction if you want, but then I just have more negatives to deal with. Here I can see those two negatives are going to write minusing the negative number makes it plus the positive. So let's see, I started with a 1, so I start with a 5 minus negative 1 in the bottom. Some tricks, right, if you look this way, those two values should come from the same point, an x value and a y value, and they do. Again, same thing here, an x value and a y value, and there those guys are. Okay, now we do our math. 1 minus negative 3, so 1 plus 3, 5 minus negative 1, 5 plus 1. So 4 sixths, also known as 2 thirds. So I said we could use our graph to see if we were in the right ballpark. So I have a positive 2 thirds, and the slope of our line is positive. And in fact, we could count the slope between two points just to make sure. So up 2 over 3, and we land on our graph again.